Hi, my name is Otto, and our group is going to talk about injection, surjection, and bijection. Injection is also known as one-to-one. -one. Surjection is known as onto. And bijection is defined as both one-to-one -one and onto. Alright. Bijection, injection, and surjection distinguish functions based on how their inputs, or the domain, and images, or the codomain, are related. So inputs and outputs, and bijection, injection, and surjection relate those two. Hi, my name is Jesse, and I'll be talking about one-to-one -one functions, also known as injections. A function is injective if it, maps to dis if it maps distinct objects to distinct objects. To say that in another way, a function is injective if and only if f of a equals f of b implies that a equals b. So, as you can see, this function that I just drew right here is injective because if, if you know the output, you can tell the input. However, if I drew this here, this function would not be injective. Here's another way to think of it. For an injective function that maps from A to B, no element of B is the image of more than one element of, in A. Let's take a look at a few examples. Let's look at f of x equals x over 2, where x is from all real numbers to all real numbers. This function is injective, or one-to-one, -one, because every number is half of only exactly one other number. For no number can you have two different numbers that are double that number. Now, let's take a look at the function f of x equals the absolute value of x. In this case, this function is not injective because for inputs such as negative 1 and 1, the output is 1, or negative 2 and 2, the output is 2. So since an output can have multiple inputs, the function is not an injection. Hello, my name is Michael, and I'm here to talk about surjection, or onto. Onto means that for all elements y that exist in the codomain b, there exists an element x that lies in the domain a, such that f at x is equal to y. Now, what that means is, given a domain A and a domain B, and let's say A has the four elements, x1, x2, x3, x4, and B contain the elements y1, y2, y3. If this function f at x equals y maps all elements in the domain to the elements, to all the elements in the codomain, then the function would be onto. So, if x1 is mapped onto y1, x2 is mapped onto y2, x3 is mapped onto y3, and x4 is also mapped onto y3, this would be an onto function. Now, let's say that this set, this codomain, contained another element, y4, that wasn't mapped onto. 
then this function would not be onto. Functions that are both one-to-one -one and onto are called bijections. They are said to have a one-to-one -one correspondence as shorthand for being both one-to-one -one and onto. One-to-one -one correspondence means that each element in the first set maps onto a single unique element in the second set and that every element of the second set is mapped to. A bijection has several useful properties. For instance, if a bijection can be found between two sets, it shows that the two sets must have the same cardinality. This is especially useful for sets that are extremely large or infinite, such as the set of all real numbers. Moreover, any bijection is invertible, that is, it has an inverse function. An inverse function maps elements of the second set back onto the elements of the first set. 